Hello, everyone. Welcome to Budapest. Uh, I'm in Budapest for a little while, so I thought I'd do a video and take you guys on my little exploration of the city. So first impression so far, it's really clean, really nice. You have these old trams right there. Super cool. You know, the architecture is really amazing. Uh, you have some of the communist architecture blended with the new modern things. Good vibe here so far. So let's uh, explore a bit. As you can see, just random buildings around town. This looks like some government building maybe. But yeah, the architecture is just really, really cool here. dishes here in Hungary. I think it's just kind of meat sauce with potatoes or something. Meat heavy here. So um, we'll, we'll try that as well. This city is really something to marvel at. You see all these cool buildings. And I haven't even showed you guys the side streets yet. I mean, every alleyway, little street is really a feast for the eyes. Wonders around the world. Very cool. Fountain, Ferris wheel, skate park. Very nice. Very nice and clean. Now we're approaching St. Stephen's Basilica. Roman style old church. It's a pretty impressive building. A nice big square here. Yeah, this is quite insane. This church. Look at the square, the, the patterns, the art. It's really cool. And back here we have another just amazing little city street. I love these patterns on the ground. Super cool. Look at the doors. Amazing. You can see painting right there. Really cool. Yeah, I think my goal with this channel is to kind of show you guys more of what's happening in the moment. Uh, you know, on the streets, you know, just walking the streets, more simple things rather than uh, more historical things. I think that that's the direction I want to take. But, um, you know, that kind of stuff interests me. I hope it interests you as well. Just seeing, you know, the vibe uh, live on the street. I think there's something uh, really special about that. I also thought about maybe, you know, putting some music in, making it a bit more artistic in that regard, but I want to keep it simple for the most part. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Here's a Soviet uh, memorial for the Russian soldiers who fought in World War II. It's really cool. You can see the star there. Very cool. All around, we're in a park. Really cool buildings everywhere as usual in this city. Now here's the Hungarian Parliament building. Wow. Really amazing architecture. You can see the flag, Hungarian flag flying right there. Right there as well. Here we have a guy on a horse, as usual. A little monument of a guy on a horse, and look at this view from out here. Wow, amazing! Look at all the detail on top of that building. And we have here the Danube River, 
second longest river in Europe. Um, separates the two sides of the city, Buda and Pest. And if I'm not mistaken, this is uh, the Pest side. And over here, that's Buda. So this is the river that kind of separates the two sides of the cities. It used to be two separate cities, but they they joined I think in the 1890s or something like this. So really cool, huge river, really beautiful. Here's another angle, the Parliament building. You can see how truly huge it is. It's massive. Yeah, architecture is super cool. Big Hungarian flag flying in the wind there. And wow, look at the, the entrance of this place. Massive lions and the detail on the gate. It's insane. Really cool. Really, really cool. The other side, but it looks like the bridge is under construction. So, looks like we have to take a ferry to get to the other side. I hope I don't get lost. Um, yeah, let's see what goes down. So, yeah, that's under construction. So, we have to see if we can catch this ferry. But I hope they take card because I don't have any cash. So we'll see if we can catch it. It'll be fun. Well, it's sold by another guy. The ferry isn't running. So, more boring, but we have to catch the bus now. So now we have to look for that. Apparently it stops right here. We'll see. Ooh, waiting for our bus now, and I must say it's scorching out here today it's like pushing 100 degrees fahrenheit 37 celsius boiling hot god i'm sweating so much just got off my bus decided just to walk this bridge might get some cool views on the way Ooh, there's a big waterfall over there dip my head in it So we're crossing over this side. So I want to show you guys uh, the fortress. There's an old fortress that looks pretty amazing. Check that out. And we're gonna eat the goulash. I'm not sure which one will come first. I'm sure one's closer, I guess. But uh, cool views from this bridge. Really cool views. Look what we're coming up on now. Like the end of the bridge, a little mountainous terrain, a little statue up there, staircase going to I guess the top of that mountain. Maybe we can climb up there. Oh, there's the water fountain. Oh, I hope I can. I really hope I can put my head under that. <laughs> Hopefully, it's allowed. I don't know if I can reach. I can feel the water though. Oh, I can't reach. Oh. So there's water splashing on my face. And it feels so good. Oh. Wow. Really cool. Okay, so now we're gonna start with that little door. Our ascent of this structure. Our staircase. And we're gonna get goulash before the fortress because it's uh, on the way to the fortress. I hope this path will take us to where we need to go. Whew, we'll see. Wow, very, very hot. Look, we have these other paths that go up, and you know me, I'm a sucker for a little climb for a viewpoint but I'm a bit hot and hungry so we're gonna keep 
going on this path. I hope, again, I'm going in the right direction. We'll see where this leads us. We're above a huge uh, interstate roadway. Oh man, I'm tired. Unfortunately, this is not the right way. I have to actually cross the intersection and go on a uh, less beautiful route, maybe. I'm sure it'll still be beautiful with uh, the architecture and buildings, but not this uh, fairy tale of a walk. Whew, so, on the way to get goulash, I'll definitely film if I see something else interesting on the way, which I'm sure I will. Some crazy shit going on. Football team or something. That was crazy. They just blocked off that intersection and let those uh, buses pass. Maybe it was a football team. It didn't look like politicians because they were in buses, but who knows? That was uh, cool. There's another cool building scattered everywhere here around the city. I mean, the architecture. The attention to detail in this city. Really something to marvel at. I mean, look at this thing. It's so beautiful. You know, I want to stop and see like every little thing like this. If I did, I would run out of time. There's just so many different little nooks and crannies of this city to explore. It's insane. Look at the front of this thing. Wow. Super nice. Yeah, so this is actually the Buddha Castle. An old castle I just looked it up. So, yeah, go check that out when you're in Budapest. Huge. Huge uh, castle. This looks like our restaurant. Right here, old-fashioned, traditional. You know how I like it. Let's uh, see what they got. Hello. Uh, just the one. Outside. Uh, inside. Oh, inside. Uh, window inside. Window. This is what we want. Or no, this one. Yeah, yeah. I'm wearing the blue wash. And a beer. And some sweaty. You can buy straight. And very hot. Like a Hungarian beer. Fair. Let's give it a try. Good little fresh one. Oh, wow, already. Wow, thank you. Beautiful. Goulash. Just give me the spicy sauce. Oh, it looks good to put in. I love spicy. It's different too. It's even good in summer. Really good. I really like this chili paste. It adds a really good flavor to a spice addict like me. I have to ask her what kind of chilies they are. 
show you guys the interior. Super homey tradition. Really cool vibe. Just what I look for in a place. Hey, uh, could you tell me what kind of chilies are made? Or what? What was this? Yeah. Okay, what's in it? I, I write it down for you, okay? okay. It's, it's interesting. It, it, I love spicy things, so I love being able to put the chilies in the... And uh, do you make it here? Uh, I can give you... We, we, no, 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 no. It's a typical Hungarian thing. Oh, okay. And uh, this is the name. Okay, that's the name. I'll look and there is up. a lighter, kind of. $7.50 for all that home cooked meal and that big beer, all of it together was $7.50, so a really good price. Uh, very good food, super high quality. You could tell it's homemade. Oof. And as I said, in the summer, it's kind of maybe not the best thing to eat because it's so freaking hot. <clears throat> but in the winter, that would hit different. But I even enjoyed it in the summer, you know? it's. It was so good, but I'm um, actually really impressed with Hungarian food uh, so far. I actually really like it. So let's continue our journey to the fortress now. Thankfully, we have some cloud coverage now. And I love this. Look at this literally modern building. And we have this old path. Wow, so cool. So this is the path to get to the fortress. I hope we continue with this cloud coverage because um, your boy is burning up. Oh man, let's continue. We're approaching the fortress right now. It's called the Fisherman's Basin. I cannot, of course, pronounce the Hungarian name. I can't pronounce anything uh, Hungarian. So, Fisherman's Basin what it means in English. So now we're entering the first part of it. Let's see what we can find in here. Oh, super cool. This is an old lookout tower. Apparently it was turreted as well, maybe with cannons, I'm assuming bow and arrow maybe, I don't know. Oh my god. Wow, look at this. Wow. Look at this rooftop. It's quite the scene. Wow. Look how beautiful it is. Oh my goodness. And over here, I think we get some really cool views. City, panoramic views. Look at this. Looks like a fairy tale. So it's really cool once you get up here. There's a little cafe right here. This, I guess this is a church, yeah. Just so gotta have a church in your fortress, right? And then there's just, these are the old towers. And here's like the lookout points. And there's the parliament building. So we were there earlier. Yeah, really nice. Sorry? Really cool. Highly recommend checking this out. Now I'm just gonna chill for a minute. It's boiling hot. I think it's actually starting to rain a bit. And um, yeah, I'm just gonna rest. I think I'm overheating a bit. I need to drink some water. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna figure out what to do next. Yeah, so. Look at this cool view. 
think that's where I'll end things today. But thanks for joining me. And I uh, hope you enjoyed that. Ate some food. I uh, explored a bit. So I'm burning up. So I'll see you next time. Maybe I'll do one more video on Budapest. But I hope you enjoyed and peace out.